Hello. Yeah, good morning. Good morning. Uh, I need to uh, speak with um, Tamika Purdue, please. I'd appreciate it. This is she. No, uh, Miss Purdue. Uh, Tamika, how you doing? This is uh, TJ. Sorry, I'm calling on behalf of the Sackleson Corporation. We're the parent company of the apartment complex that you're renting out of. Mm-hmm. Found a little bit of information out from one of my um, maintenance men out there, Julio, one of our yard boys over there. Well. Apparently, Julio says that he saw an animal in your windowsill. He says that he saw a cat. So we're going to have to go ahead and evict you. Um, My mom has a key to the apartment. She has a cat. She brings it over here. But he's at my mom's house. That's irrelevant, Miss Purdue. There's to be no animals on the premises whatsoever. I mean, but it's at, at my mom's house. Was the cat in your house or not? She brought it. It was in the car. My brother you're had stuttering, Miss Purdue, please don't stutter. That just that tells me that you're lying. I feel like you're lying. Excuse me, Would but you, that's my mother's cat. I mean, but I don't give a damn whose cat it is, all right? I mean, I done seen somebody at the end of with a, a parrot. I'm pretty sure that that wasn't the tent. So you probably here me. cussing at me, talking about I don't care, I've, yet, I've yet to curse you. I don't have an animal. I work two jobs. I'm only at home three days a week. You don't know my business. I get here at 11 o'clock p.m. Monday through Wednesday. I don't have time to tend to an animal. If you like, we can get you to the end of the week. We can extend out the eviction notice, and we'll give you a little bit more time to get your furniture and stuff together. You know, if fuck I'm... you, because I'll be gone. The person you called is no longer on the line. Hello? Hello? This is Purdue. Yes, I told you, you that's my hold mother's cat. This is my mother on the phone right now. The phone? No, I don't know, Miss Purdue. First off, tell don't you ever tell him that's your cat. Now tell my mama how you. Hold on, hold on. No, I did not. All I said you was that. Let me tell you something. You were unprofessional calling here. You know what you said. Tell my mother my, exactly mama what Purdue, you said. Mom, first off, uh, this mom. is how he's talking right now. Tell my some mama Purdue. First, uh, Mrs. Purdue, uh, Mother Purdue. Yes. Okay, this is um, TJ Sartre. And what we have going on, our yard boy Julio, one of the yard maintenance men over there, says that he saw an animal in Mrs. Purdue's window sill. Now, she went on to tell me about birds and parrots and crows and damn dogs on people's shoulders. You, you want to talk, sweetheart. Sweetheart, no, it was my sweetheart, turn to talk. I get the fuck out, but you kiss my ass. You hear me? You don't call here telling that shit like that. I can go to my mama house. So fuck you and fuck me. Sweetheart, sweetheart. Fuck you, sweetheart. Sweetheart, you really need to settle down. No, nah, you you got loud with me the first time you called, acting the way you did, cursing at me. Now you ain't you acting like I that because my mom you. is on the phone. I never. You was a lie. My voice. You is a lie. Now I'm just not raising mine because the way you call here at me at first. Now you tell. Julio to kiss my ass and you do the same because I'm finna leave this bitch Miss, right motherfucking now. Uh, ma- now you kiss Mama my Purdue. ass, you bitch. Mama Purdue. Fuck you, I'm finna hang up. Mama Purdue, why is your daughter such a heathen? The person you called is no longer on the line. <laughs> what do you want? Tamika, it's Roy Wood Jr. Why don't play with me like that? That shit went funny. <laughs> we sorry, girl. Your brother, um, Jaquel Purdue is the one who put us up to it, girl. He put, I'm gonna kick his ass when I get the Hoover. That shit. Hey, funny. All right, Miss Purdue. Thanks for playing. Bye bye. Bye bye.